Hello guys, how are you? Uh, welcome in this uh, new video. I got the idea of doing this video from uh, this video of our friend here in Iris server. In this video, he, he has extracted the uh, Lenovo file of or Lenovo BIOS image file of uh, U530 touch laptop using two tools so as I always say in my videos I love things being quick and easy I am going to extract the same I'm going to show you how to extract the same uh, extract the same image from this file our friend uh, uses here with only the HXD editor. So let's download the file. I, uh, to do that, I am going to use uh, the name of the file he has ex downloaded. So the name of the file he has downloaded is 7ccn62www.exe. Uh, so let me note this name on a paper so 7ccn62www.exe I am going to use this name instead of uh, the name of the model of the laptop uh, to get it quickly so let's go to Google here and type uh, the name 7ccn62wtwice.exe enter the first result will be yeah exactly the file our friend uses in his video so let's download it let's uh, let's create I think I already have uh, no there's not a file with his name so let's create a new file um, let's just name it pit stop simply open download save our file in that folder so with the right click here show in folder here we have our file so what i do uh, in case of uh, these uh, like these files i just open them with the hxd directly so we're going to follow same steps as our friend let's search for yours I am sorry. I am G. Here all. Okay. Here we have it. So the file start. The just image start from here. From here. Starts from here. So we are going to click here. Click here. Don't forget. You have to click here go to the beginning of the file and and with the shift hold the shift key on your keyboard and click here so that everything is selected back from to uh, from the uh, image to the beginning of the file so we delete we we delete with our keyboard and we do right click here we select the block exactly as our friend has done in his video we use the lint file lint of the 8 megabyte files it's a standard lint for for 8 megabyte file bios files okay so here we have the end of it's always it always can be recognized by this E flash A E N E M G. So we click here, here, and we go to the end of the file. We and holding down the shift key, we click here, 
so that everything is selected from the end of the BIOS image till the end of this .exe file which we have opened with the HXD editor. Hit delete. So here we have our BIOS image. If we select all with the control A, we have the exact length here of BIOS image files of 8 megabyte. BIOS. So we save it as uh, in the same folder desktop. Uh, let's open desktop. So we just rename it to dot bin. Here we have our file. Uh, let's extract it with LBE uh, which will do it automatically and uh, at the end we are going to uh, compare the two files this one and the one that we will get uh, with LBE so close this I'm going to open the LBE So, for those having this tool, they can use it to extract it automatically. We are going to use uh, the universal extractor for this one. Even if we use the uh, Lenovo extractor here, which we have here, I don't think it will extract it because as it can't be extracted with the RAR program, as we have seen in pit stop this video so uh, no need to use this one i'm going to use the universal extractor so i'm going to open the dot exe file here go to desktop pit stop uh, this one and uh, here we have the options so we have uh, rar option tempo uh, the temporary extraction process the file directly let's use this one try this one if it fails we can opt for the other ones oh, okay let's hit start it's done and it's opened automatically so the the LBE uh, has, has saved them in uh, automatically in LBE folder installation folder so I'm going to select uh, in fact it has extracted two files one with the with the standard size of 8 megabyte and the other one is a little bit uh, bigger so we are going to copy copy this one and move and paste it in this folder so now we have the one extracted automatically with the view and the one we have extracted with our H, uh, HXD editor now the moment of truth let's compare the two files so we have opened this one the first one which we have extracted with hxd editor and the second one which uh, which we have extracted with the lbo file so let's analyze the two files and compare them as you can see the chosen files are identical so the manual way of extracting this BIOS using HXD is successful. I hope you have learned something new. In fact, uh, it's the same thing as our friend but without using the another tool. So we, I am using only the HXD editor. It's like uh, in programming, instead of using for example, 20 line of code. Uh, if we can use only 10 or 15, it will be better in our coding. Just an example. So I always love things being simple.
and I hope uh, the video is clear. If any question will come, and uh, I have to go now. No much time. So bye bye.